he is our achiever of the day powered by college dekho banayenge india ka kal uh, but well it's not about kal it's about aaj and he really made our aaj a very happy today that's rohit sharma 92 runs of 41 balls a 225 strike rate seven fours eight sixes he got a 19 ball 50 What makes it even more interesting is the fact that he lost his opening partner Virat Kohli for a duck. You think intuitively you think oh captain mm-hmm. Australia. I kid you not if you had 10 out of 10 people riding outside they go oh no no he'll he'll bat a little slow he'll be a little watchful. Nobody would have got 50 of 19. 50 of a team total of 52 on their bingo card today. No nah, that's right and uh He's making those statements off the field. This is how we play, yeah. and living it, and leading it, and uh, it, it's inspirational stuff. It's great, great to watch. Just great entertainment. Yeah. Um, and question marks around his T20 impact of you know over the you know IPL stats and yeah. at the top of the order and so on. But uh, that's just again a reinforcement of the value of his leadership. And, and how valued I think that team find him and 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 are inspired by him. So uh, yeah, it's just courageous, courageous play. But really, really good stroke selection, knowing what uh, where to go to put the bowler off. Spoke about it at at, uh, at the half time break where he he goes down the wicket to to put them off length. Um, so it's uh, yeah, it's just. Not much more you can say other than it's, it's brilliant. He was <laughs> yeah. absolutely the player of the day. You know the thing with good guidance is they always say you can either tell me or you can show me, mm. right? And the kind of preparation that that Rohit has been doing is is what he's been talking about all through. And today we really we saw him embody that. Well, he's he's big on preparation. You know, we keep talking about how how much time he spends in terms of uh, analyzing data as well you know yeah. looking at the numbers looking mm. at the opposition looking at the tactics yeah. uh, so uh, he is he is someone who loves having those kind of conversations you know so the the support staff to the the guys the bowlers the batters you know his his mind is always ticking that way mm. and uh, he's been consciously making this effort right from the the 50 over world cup yeah. where you know he wanted to be uh, that uh, uh, he he wanted the team to be a uh, aggressive team uh, when it comes to batting as well uh, he wanted to play the situations uh, differently uh, yeah. approach uh, scenarios differently and he's he's achieved that you know by by giving those statements uh, that's one uh, but also uh, adding to that he's going out there and he's delivering it himself mm-hmm. you look at the shot also which he was the intent which he was showing even when he was in 90s yeah. he was not playing for his 100 you know if he, if yeah. it's a good ball gets him out it's fine but his intent was to put bowlers under pressure i think we often hear leaders say it's not about the results it's about the process mm-hmm. well he he stated what the process should yeah. be and that's be yeah. aggressive yeah. at all costs you lose your batting partner no have your process and go and deliver it so that sort of expertise as a leader and the guidance that he's giving his playing 11 that they know the trajectory they're on and they're learning from him and going with him They really uh, I mean today Rohit has led by example he's always been saying that the milestones don't matter for this team and today he showed it but 92 he was still wanting to go hammer and tongs and uh, put Australia on the mat so yeah that's why Rohit is our achiever of the day powered by college dekho banayenge india ka kal and uh, yeah there's just like college dekho uh, helps guide your child's future he has uh, basically guided india into well the semi final for sure maybe to the final as well who knows